Well, we finally finished up everything on Vold that we could do. We did the main storyline, got uh, Moshai Sefa, uh, sort of a higher figure in the Ungaran world. Um, we're going to go talk to her as well as uh, Jal on the next, not on the Nexus, on the Tempest. And then we are going to head back to Aya to finish up some of those main story missions and other things that we've got going on. Uh, we've cleared up a lot of them, so let's finish up some more. Jal? Thank you for checking. But I'm all right. Don't know if I would be. I have to be. How else do we go on? At some point soon, we better get busy making babies. True enough. Who knew this thing was just a glorified dating service? Thanks for talking, Ryder. Okay. Where? Hmm. Oh. <laughs> I should get back to work. Talk to my people, see if they've heard anything. Chat later. Whoa. That she runs. They all do that. They, they like, run to their specific spot. It's a terrible programming habit. Can I show you something? Whoa. Don't whip it out. bring anything from the Milky Way? The important thing is, it's coming. And always will be. Let's talk to the Moshai. Just need to rest up a bit while I recover my strength. I thought you said we could come by and talk whenever I wanted, you dickhole. Wow. Callow's very excited about a report I received from EOS. It's good news. The radiation levels are steadily dropping. So radiation levels are down. More to explore? I yes, but there's been a rise in cat activity as well. Figures that we're not the only ones to benefit from the planet's improvement. Maybe we'll head back at some point. Well, you're the boss. Just say the word. That's so dumb. We've already been back. That was... <laughs> Part 16 was the cat base. We cleaned it out. We're done. Bro, you're like a month and a half behind. Welcome to paradise. Are we going to be hailed as heroes? Stars and skies light our way. Stars and skies light our way. She knows how to play to a crowd. <laughs> she's the Moshai. I don't know what that means, man. Like, she's a high religious figure, I guess? Welcome home. I never thought I'd see it again. Without the Resistance and the Pathfinder, I wouldn't be here. We made a good team. We freed more than just the Moshai. And the Pathfinder killed a Ket leader. We have a lot to celebrate. We've been alone against the Ket for too long. You've proven it doesn't have to be that way. It's time we discussed an alliance between our people. We're happy to make room for you on the Nexus. We'll provide an embassy here as well. Our city is open to you. Join us. Fantastic, finally. Well done, Jal. Report for reassignment. I need to stay with the Pathfinder. Yeah, he's staying with us. He's mine now. Jal has already become a valued member of my crew. Of course he has. I see the benefit. Request granted. I need to file a mission report. Don't leave Aya without me. What happens if we... Like, that'd be kind of cool if we could. Exultation is just another word for how to kick kill us. And if you're wrong, if we've been killing for them without realizing it? I saw a cat up close when they attacked. It was nothing like our people. I've seen different types of cat. They could be exalting multiple species. Anything they transform is an abomination. We have to destroy the creatures. Thank you for that. Insight, Pathfinder. The issue facing us is complex. Come, my friends. Deliberate with me. At least they're talking about it, not just getting, like, pissed off at each other. Pretty cool. Eladin. Good news? Pathfinder, did you make it to Havara? I found this Ingaran helmet. Does it mean anything to you? This is a pre-Dark Age design. Do you see the black marks? The Scourge targeted this pilot's ship. Stars, it's perfectly preserved. 
I can almost imagine the pilot. He must have been so afraid. I've never seen one of these intact. Do you know how rare this is? I can't even begin to repay you. I did it for you. Uh -huh. You know, Pathfinder, this gets me thinking. If it wasn't for you, we wouldn't even know that helmet existed. What if that's not all we're missing? There could be a wealth of history just out of our reach. So, I'm requesting your help again. For you? Anything. I'd be lying if I said I didn't like the sound of that. What I ask is this. If you ever find yourself in an area like that, you keep an eye out for artifacts. That's it? That's it. Keep me in mind as you explore and bring me anything of interest. Getting lots of stares. Reminds me of being on Thessia for a sorry commando training. We're the aliens. Let me see if I can just fast travel over. Oh, well, we've got that to go do. So yeah, let's not fast travel too much. Sort of kills the immersion as well. Then again, how often do you see somebody just running around like this? Don't start any trouble and we're fine. I can do that. Good to hear. That's uh, Addison's voice. Whoa! Five thousand pages! <sighs> That's nuts. Let's go to the vault. See if we can activate it then. And that'll probably be it. That looks like a low res, low poly model right there. I haven't brought anyone here in over 20 years. There's always been an active display for Aya, but we could never affect it. Let's see what we can do. Sam? Yes, this is new. Is it similar to the vault on Eos? Tell me, what are you seeing? I think what we need to figure out is what's different. Tell me. What do you see? The vaults. They're a network, as you discovered. However... They're not connected to each other, but to this place. This image was on a relic the Archon showed me. He called it Meridian. And it looks like Aya's vault is the only one that's fully connected to it. And it's terraforming. Doing what it was meant to do. The vault on Eos is also present, but changed. <clears throat> Our interfacing with it has affected its connection. Hmm. What do you think, Professor? I think that Meridian is the control center for all the vaults. Wow. So we can activate them all? Well, oh, it's... They sort of... May... I mean, it's a typical science fiction sort of thing, but the similar thing in Halo with the, uh, the Halo rings. It, whatever, you know, that's, that's sort of fine with me. We want to activate them all at once, get this whole place terraformed and working. Thank you. This is unbelievable. If we can get to Meridian, maybe we can turn everything on from there. Make Helios live. Wait, Ryder. The Archon knows where it is. He's already been there. What? Where? Meridian? Of course. That's why he tortured me. He thought I could help him use it. Because he can't. Meridian is my people's best chance for survival. We have to take it from him. Agreed. Such power in the hands of such evil could mean the end of your people and mine. <clears throat> You're going to need that relic I saw. The Resistance might have intel on the whereabouts of Archon's ship. I'll talk to Ephra and secure his full cooperation. Meet me there. That's a lot of vaults. It's a lot of planets. It's a lot of work. We need to find the Ket command ship. Tell him the truth about my capture. Moshai, please. It may be our only route to the Archon. One of my men helped the Ket take her. 
A resistance commander named Venturev. The Archon wanted her knowledge of Remnant Tech, but why would Ven betray her? I don't know. That's why I kept it quiet. I'm working to capture him, make him answer for what he did. You know where he is? Kadar report. My contacts are hunting him. I need the relic that leads to Meridian, and I can handle my people. Let me do this. I don't like it. I don't care. The Pathfinder is right. I'll transmit my files on Kadara Port to your ship. Our traitor could have useful information. We need him alive. That's up to him. Be safe, Pathfinder. As for you, Ephra, we're not done. Uh-oh. Fight, fight, fight. Nice, level 30. Mm. Let's circle back to the Nexus for a few things. Call me Ether de Navarre. Welcome, Ambassador. The Angara's first formal visit will be one for the history books. I wonder what they'll say. Seventy-five years ago, we were scattered, struggling to rebuild after the Scourge. Then, the Ket arrived. Alien life. It was monumental. But then they deceived and enslaved us. So, I hope you understand my precautions. We don't expect you to enter this alliance blindly, Ambassador. Everything we say, you can check. You'd be that open with us? We have nothing to hide. They'll surrender their weapons to your militia, if that's satisfactory. Thank you. We won't disappoint you, Ambassador. Pavoa set Jav Teravon, Pathfinder. Welcome to Andromeda. Nice little welcome. Okay. So I guess these are apartments, not some cool little spot. So yeah, let's let's have PBs be number one. And we'll cut it here. So we've made some really good progress, sort of... Uh, most of the beginning part was talking with the crew members after Vold. Um, we were able to finally go to Aya and we're making a sort of peaceful sort of connection with the Angaran people. It's all going smoothly. Part 24. We'll continue uh, some of the side mission things in the Nexus, sort of clean up anything we have there, and then head over to Kadara. Um, maybe do that other side mission with the, the satellites, then head over to Kadara, find the outpost and the exiles over there, and hopefully see some interesting animations and everything. Uh, so that's all for us today. Thanks for watching, everybody. Be sure to tune in next week, of course, for all of the uh, continued fun things. Otherwise, check out the other videos. And we will cut it here. Enjoy the day, and I'll catch you next time.